Have you ever stopped and wondered about the speed of light and why it's such a universal constant in our universe? This mesmerizing speed, clocking in at an astounding 670 million miles per hour, is not just a random number, it underpins the fabric of our reality, from the twinkling of distant stars to the functionality of our GPS systems. As we embark on this journey through time and space, we'll uncover 10 intriguing facts that will illuminate your minds. Before we delve into the specifics of light speed, let's take a moment to appreciate the mystique surrounding it. Throughout history, light speed has been a topic of fascination, prompting countless scientific endeavors and experiments. The ancient Greeks pondered over it, the Renaissance scholars theorized about it, and even today our understanding of the universe hinges on the constant speed of light. A particularly intriguing fact is that measuring the speed of light was a monumental achievement in scientific history. The first successful measurement was made in the late 17th century by Danish astronomer Ole Romer. He cleverly used the motion of Jupiter's moon, Io, to compute the speed of light this revelation marked a pivotal moment in science, transforming our understanding of the universe. The speed of light, once a mystery, now a cornerstone of modern physics. This journey of discovery and understanding is what makes the speed of light not just a scientific fact, but a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity. As we delve into the specifics of light speed, let's keep this spirit of inquiry alive. Fact number one. The speed of light denoted as the letter C is approximately 299,792 kilometers per second. That means a beam of light is so fast it can circle the Earth over seven times in the blink of an eye. This constant speed is a fundamental cornerstone of physics. As we will see later, nothing can travel faster. It is the ultimate speed limit. Fact number two. The speed of light in a vacuum is constant. The unchanging speed of light is one of the fundamental constants of nature. In a vacuum, it doesn't matter if the light is red, blue, or any color in between, its speed remains the same. But light does slow down when traveling through different transparent media such as water or glass. This process is called refraction. The rate at which light decelerates depends on its wavelength. This is why light spreads out through raindrops causing rainbows and how Newton created his spectrum using a prism. Fact number three, according to Einstein, the speed of light is constant and does not depend on the motion or place of the observer. The way a wave source changes according to the motion of the wave source or wave receiver is well known. It is called the Doppler effect. You experience an example of the Doppler effect every day without even realizing. The sound of an approaching car appears to rise in pitch as it comes towards you and falls as it goes away. This is because the sound waves are compressed, made higher in pitch, as the car approaches. As the car passes and then goes away, the sound waves are stretched out, made lower in pitch. Light, however, does not act in the same way. Its speed is constant no matter the speed of its source and whether it is coming toward you, stationary or receding, a mind-bending fact that shows you the fundamental nature of light. Fact number four, the speed of light affects time. Consider this. The faster you move, the slower time appears to pass for you compared to anything around you. This is the intriguing concept of time dilation. Imagine you're in a spaceship traveling near light speed. Everything outside would seem to be in fast forward while your onboard clock would tick normally. This is because light speed is our cosmic speed limit. It dictates the rhythm of time itself. Light sets the tempo for our universe's cosmic dance. Fact number five, we measure astronomical distances in light years. Space is so vast that we needed another way to measure distance. So we use the light year, which is the distance that light, zipping along at about 186,000 miles per second, can travel in a year. So when we say a star is several light years away, we're stating how far the light from that star has traveled and how long it has taken to reach us. It's a breathtaking thought. When we gaze at stars, we're actually looking back in time. Fact number six, nothing can move faster than light. Light speed isn't just a speed limit. As we said before, it's the speed limit of the universe. This isn't due to some cosmic traffic law enforcement, but because of how our universe is structured. As an object accelerates, its energy increases, which in turn increases its mass. This is a consequence of Einstein's famous equation, E equals mc squared. 
As objects get closer to the speed of light, they become heavier, requiring more energy to accelerate them to be faster, making it impossible to reach light speed. Fact number seven, the speed of light is central to Einstein's theory of relativity. This theory gave us the iconic equation E equals mc squared. Here, E symbolizes energy, m represents mass, and c stands for the speed of light. This equation tells us that energy and mass are interchangeable with the speed of light acting as the conversion factor. The larger the mass, the greater the energy, and it's all tied together by the speed of light. It's a testament to light speed's fundamental role in our universe. Fact number eight, light speed defines energy. As we have seen, light speed is an essential factor in the relationship between mass and energy. Think about Einstein's famous equation that we have already met, E equals mc squared. The equation shows us that the energy of an object is equal to its mass times the square of the speed of light. The amount of energy in even a small amount of material is immense and the basis for our most awful weapons. The speed of light is more than just a speed, it's a bridge between matter and energy. Fact number nine, information can't travel faster than light. Light speed governs not just the transmission of light, but also information itself. The fastest that we can send a message through space is at the speed of light. Imagine sending a text message to Mars like NASA does every day with its Mars rovers. It takes between 5 to 20 minutes to arrive depending on the relative position of the planets, even at the speed of light. This is because the information carried by our devices is bound by the same cosmic speed limit. In essence, light speed sets the pace for our universe, our communications, and the pace of the universe. Fact number 10, having said that nothing can travel faster than light, we come to the theory of quantum entanglement. This theory challenges our understanding of light speed and our view of the universe itself. In quantum entanglement, two particles become linked and as a result they share properties regardless of the distance between them. If you change the property of one linked particle, you change the other particle in the same way. We can understand this if the particles are close to each other. But if we keep one particle and move the other to the other side of the universe, when we change the property of our particle, the other changes in the same way, instantaneously. It's like two intertwined dancers spinning in unison no matter how far apart they are. This curious phenomenon, while not yet fully understood, continues to baffle and excite scientists. Quantum mechanics is always keeping scientists on their toes. So, we've journeyed through the fascinating world of light speed. We've seen how it's defined, how it behaves in a vacuum, and its intimate dance with time and distance. We've touched on its limitations and its role in the equation that changed everything. We've explored how it influences energy, information, and even quantum entanglement. We've measured it and marveled at its constancy. Next time you switch on a light, remember, you're tapping into one of the universe's fundamental constants.